Okay, he got E. So he actually reaching across, turn your hips, downward Manucci, step forward with your back foot, step away from your partner with your left foot, down on your right knee, and pin. Okay, a couple more times on that side. So, Sugiyashi, reach across. Remember, that's a potential atemi, potential strike. And by the way, Senpai, when you come here, your elbow is a potential strike if you need to. So you have a potential atemi here, potential atemi here. Okay, so that's in there. And later on, we'll learn more about those strikes. Turn your hips, drop down, big step in, big step away, down on the right knee. Okay, let's do one more. Offline, reach across, turn the hips, drop, big step, omote, step away, down on the right knee. Okay, let's do the other side. So, migi hanami. Sugiyashi, right hand comes up, hand blade to the face, to your left shoulder, turn your hips, your left hand goes to their elbow, downward manucci. So again, omote, you probably can't do all the way over here because your body is right there, right there, because they're shooting for your leg or your hip. And so you're down here, so their body's right there. So I probably have to come over here for my omote. And then offline, away with the back leg, take them off their center, down on the left knee. Take a step with your right foot so you have more leverage here to lean in for the pin. Okay. So Migi, Sugiyashi, across to the shoulder, turn the hips, downward Manucci, Omote, right leg steps away, down on the left knee. Solid pin. Use your weight, use your gravity to keep them down, and then use your leverage, your lean, to push the arm over. So using gravity and leverage. Okay, a couple more like that. Migi, Sugiyashi, reach, grab, rotate, down, step, over, and down. Pin. Okay, one more like that. Migi, Sugiyashi, hand blade, reach, rotate, down, step, over, and down on the left knee. Okay, now let's go back to the other side. Hidari, Sugiyashi again, but now we'll finish Uda. Okay, Hidari, Sugiyashi, reach across, turn the hips, downward Manucci. Now instead of stepping up here with my right leg, I'm gonna step over here, Ura. Now, Probably Ura is a really good choice because if I have my partner right down here, if they're shooting from my front leg or hip and they're right here, right down in front of me, Ura is probably a good choice to get away from them. So right foot off, left foot back, Tenkai, down on the right knee. Okay, so hopefully that makes sense to you, Senpai. Ura is probably a good choice for this. If they're shooting for your hip, your front side, going to Ura is getting more away from them instead of stepping right towards it. Okay? So, Sugiyashi, reach, rotate the hips, downward Manucci, Uda, right foot over, left foot back, Tenkai down on the right knee. Okay, a couple more like that. Left side forward, Sugiyashi, left hand blade to the right shoulder. Turn the hips, downward Manucci, Ura. So back leg goes over, front leg comes back, Tenkai down on the right knee. Sugiyashi, Manucci, shoulder, Turn the hips, downward Manucci, 
Right foot over, left foot back, Tenkai, sink. Okay. Let's do a few on the other side. Uda. Okay, so migi han mi. Sugihashi, right hand blade is out, comes to the left shoulder. Rotate your hips for your power. And take them off your shoulder and down. Now instead of stepping, omote, back foot steps over, right foot back, jankai, sink down on the left knee. And Sugiyashi, oops, okay, so we're over on this side, pardon me. Sugiyashi, turn the hips, down, oop, this is the other side. Over, back, tenkai, down, in. Okay. Nigi Hanmi, Sugiyashi, reach. Grab, turn the hips, downward Manucci, left foot, over, right foot back, Tenkai, sink down on the left knee, good. So Yashi, Manucci, grab to the shoulder, use your hips to get downward Manucci, Ura, so you step over with your left foot, step back with your right foot, Tenkai, sink, again. Okay, one more time. Migi, Sugiyashi. Okay, tell you what, Senpai, we'll do one more time together, then I'll watch you do it a couple times. Okay, so that's Migi. Hey. We're a finish. Okay. So Senpai, start up in Migi Han Mi, right leg forward. And I'm going to take a look once or twice. Okay. Hi. Hey. Nice finish. Nice start. Very good posture. That was very, very good to see. Now I'm going to mention one thing and it's a detail. Let me show you if you want to watch me. All of you did really good. Coming offline, coming here, turning your hips, now we're Manucci. Now it's just that you stepped a little bit up front there, right? Instead of back here for Ura. So we want to be distinct, distinct between omote and ura. So omote, my back foot steps up, even though I probably can't step right here because her body's there, I might have to step more over here. So omote could be anywhere from here to here. Ura, I want to be over here. I want to go around her body. See if you can imagine my partner. So. My partner's coming in on me here. Come offline, I grab, I bring them down. So their head is here and their body is here and their legs are here. So I need to step here behind their legs for Ura, right? Their torso, their body is here, their legs are somewhere here. So I need to step over here. So I'm not stepping right in front of their legs. So guys, when you do that step, all this is good. Instead of stepping up, step over. Imagine you're stepping behind their legs. Instead of up, I step over and then back to turn. Let's do that together. Okay, good. You guys are doing that. Let's do that one more time together. Okay, so Sugiyashi, reach across, turn your hips, drop the Minuchi. My left foot's not going to step up and step over away and behind from my partner, then step back with the right leg. Okay, good. You were doing that with me, so you had some practice there. 
Let me have a look now. So, ready? You're in Migi. Right leg forward. Height. Yes. Let's see that one more time, please. So set up in Migi, Hanmi. Ready? Height, dozo. Good turn and good finish. Okay, now Titus and Odin. Another detail. I might have to ask Siler to do this when he comes back, too. When you do your downward Manucci, when you do your hip turn to downward Manucci, watch my front foot. See how that turns? That gives me more room to turn the hips. That allows me to turn the hips even more. If I keep my front foot kind of there, it doesn't doesn't turn much, then I can't turn as far and I get twisted. If I open up that foot, I'm not twisted as much and I can turn a little bit further. So when you do downward Manucci, when you turn the hips to do downward Manucci, you want that front foot to open or to turn. Let me do one or two facing the camera. So I do Sugiyashi, I reach across, now see my front foot? I'm about to do hip turn to get my downward Manucci. Watch my front foot. And then you stepped where you did that really well. And your guys' finish is really excellent. You have a nice strong turn. Now watch me do that one more time. I'm gonna do it on the other side. Okay, so I have Hidari. So I do Sugiyashi, reach across, potential Atemi, potential Atemi. Now watch when I do my hip turn, downward Manucci, watch that front foot. I get even more hip turn. Okay, so take your time to do that part. So set up again, ready? Migi han mi. Take your time, don't be in a hurry. Height dozo. Yes. Every one of you did it. I like that so much. I'd like to see it one more time, please. So set up again. So all three of you, you opened up that foot. Excellent. And everything else looks really good. Let's take one more look at that. Ready? I like how you didn't hurry through that too. You can take all the time you want. You don't have to be all doing it exactly the same time. That's okay. You don't have to. I want to see clear, controlled, concise, precise movement. Not fast stuff. Ready? Hi, dozo. Yep. Silo, try to keep those live toes at the end. Okay, fantastic. Now, let's just do the other side once or twice because I want to see you do that hip turn. Open that foot up on the other side. Make sure we're doing it on the other side. So let's do Hadadi. I'll do uh, one or two with you. Okay, so left side forward. Sugiyashi, reach across, open up that front foot for more hip turn. And we're still doing Ura, so our right foot's over. Step back, turn down. Very nice. We won't go back and do Omote, we'll just do Ura. So let's do that one more time together. Hidari, Sugiyashi, reach over, open that front leg to get more hip turn. Then step off with the right foot, back with the left foot. Good, okay guys, so if you sit up here, get out of eat. So again, take your time when you demonstrate this. Ready? Height dozo. Yes. So other knee, Odin, that's right. Let's see it again. Coming together pretty good. Left side forward, ready. Height, dozo. Nicely done, guys, nicely done. 
Okay, let's move on to Ayumi Ashi. So that's very good movement. You're getting the footwork. Two thumbs up for that. So moving on to the next footwork. So same thing, but now we do Ayumi Ashi. So let's do that. So let's start Migi Hanmi. Right side forward. Ayumi Ashi. Left hand reaches up to reach across. Open up that front leg, that front foot for a big hip turn, downward Manucci. We're doing Omote now, back to Omote. So we're, we're not going to step over with the right foot. We're going to step up or in with the right foot. But they're probably right below it, so I might have to step over here a little bit. Step back with the left foot. Tenkai down on the right knee. Bend. Okay. So that's Migi Hanmi. Ayumi Ashi. Left hand up. Across. Grab at the shoulder. Open your front foot, your front leg for a big hip turn. Downward Manucci. Step forward with the right foot. Maybe you can't go here because your body is there. So over a little bit. Left foot steps away from your partner and down on the right knee. Okay, Migi Hanmi. Ayumi Ashi, left hand blade. Left hand comes to the right shoulder. Open your front foot, your right leg, to your left leg, left leg turn, so you have more hip turn. Downward Manucci, step up with your right foot, step away with your left foot, down on the right knee. A couple more times. Right side forward. Ayumi Ashi. Big hip turn, open up that front leg, front foot, downward, step. Up with the right foot, away with the left foot, down on the right knee. Okay, Senpai, let's do that one more time. And then I'll watch you do that. That's Migi. Sugiyashi. Reach up, reach across. Big turn, downward Manucci. Step up with the right foot, away with the left. Down on the right knee. Okay, Senpai, let's have you sit up here, Migi. Right side forward. Hi, Dozo, Ayumi Ashi. Yes. Okay. And let's see that once more. Hi, Dozo. Yes, yeah, so open up that front foot. Okay, guys. Other knee, Senpai. Senpai Titus, other knee. Let's do one more. Right side forward. Ready? Height, dozo. Good. Yeah, open up that leg. Okay. Let's do the other side. Hidari. Ayumi Ashi, right hand comes up to the face, across the shoulder. Big hip turn, open up that right leg for a big hip turn. Downward Manucci. Omote, left leg comes up. Probably not here because your body's there. Maybe over here a bit. And then my right leg steps away, take them off the center, down on the left knee. Okay, so that's Hidari. Ayumi Ashi. Right hand blade comes up and then reaches across. Big hip turn, downward Manucci. Left leg steps up for Omote. Right foot steps away to get them away from their center. Down on the left knee. Okay, Senpai, a couple more times. Left leg forward. Ayumi Ashi, right hand blade comes up, comes across to grab, turn, big turn, downward Manucci, left foot step up, right foot step away, down on the left knee. 
Okay, one more time. Aumiyashi, Minucci to the shoulder, big hip turn, downward Minucci, step up, step away, 10. Okay. So that will be good for today. Let's do a little wind down. Nice, good posture. Weight through the legs. Upper body's open and relaxed. Centered here. It's right below the belly button. Breathing in, you expand from there. Breathe out, you come back to rest and settle there. Good, now let's just stand here and breathe into the belly and practice weight underside. But you know, what's really helpful is to contrast, to do things incorrect. So it's very clear in our mind, the difference between incorrect and correct. So contrasting is a very useful tool, a very good learning tool. So instead of weight underside, let's do weight upper side. This is weight upper side, right? Everything comes up, shoulders come up, muscles get tight, everything comes up. Let's weight upper side. Go ahead and do that with me. This is contrasting. Weight upper side, now weight underside. Weight upper side, that's tension, right? It's tight, it's tense. And most people are weight upper side to one degree or another. We want weight underside. Let's contrast that one more time. Weight upper side and weight underside. Now let's just practice weight underside. Breathing good in the belly, keeping weight underside. That keeps the body calm and the mind calm. Weight underside. That's really what we want. Now you might have noticed, Senpai, that when we did that contrasting, weight upper side, weight underside, that might have reminded you of one of the breathing exercises we do. So for example, we do this when we breathe in through the nose, breathe everything up and in, and then breathe out through the mouth, everything down and out. So that actually is very similar that we want to contrast. We want to kind of tighten and hold in so we can really release and let go. So it's a basic relaxation technique to, to tighten and flex and then release. When you tighten and flex and then release, Often that allows you to release and relax even more. So that contrast is very help, very helpful. So that one breathing exercise we do, that's part of what we're doing is we're tightening for a moment so we can really relax and let go. So it makes a very clear, distinct difference between weight upper side and weight underside, or a very distinct, clear difference between tension and tightness and relaxing and letting go. So let's finish with that breathing. So you breathe in through the nose, come up on your toes, tighten everything with the shoulders up, you're tightening on purpose so you can really relax on the out breath. So let's do this together. Breathe in, weight upper side. Breathe out, weight upper side. A couple more times, breathe in, pulling everything in so we can really let everything out and let go. One more time. Okay, resting at the center. Again, the center is called the Hara, H-A-R-A, -A, Hara. And another word that sometimes we use for the center is Tondin, Tondin, Hara or Tondin. Breathe in through the belly, feeling the belly, breathe out from the belly, emptying the belly. Breathe in, it's like you're breathing in all the way down to the belly, filling it. And it's like you're breathing out from the belly, emptying it out. Good, okay, let's let's bow out, Senpai. どうもありがとうございます。
Thank you very much. Okay, senpai, have a good weekend. Bye-bye.